at 6 o'clock, a new ranking of Austin ISD's top performing schools contains some campuses that just a few years ago were not performing so well. It's a dramatic turnaround. KXAN's Phil Prazen takes an in-depth look at what appears to be the secret to academic success at Blackshear Elementary. Not every school will have a professional violinist come in to teach youngsters how to play the strings. You can show me on your violin which one's the D string. But at Blackshear Elementary, staff here say the discipline and the listening skills learned in the fine arts help discipline and listening in math and English. Every student here gets daily instruction in things like music, dance, photography, or stage performance. You can apply some of those lessons to your classroom lessons as well. Principal Rick Garner says despite having 70% of students here qualify for free or reduced lunch, they can still be recognized across the country. You don't want to write anyone off. You come into it saying, we're going to get there. Since they turned the school around two years ago, word must have spread. This year, they have an increase in 90 students from the year before. They say it's because of the fine arts program and community partnerships through the likes of Ballet Austin, Kids Acting Foundation, and the Hispanic Alliance. Without them, we would have a very, very difficult time without our community partners. Monday, they received an award from the nonprofit Children at Risk, hoping they can be an example to encourage other schools throughout the state. Phil Prazen. KXAN News. While they still spend the majority of the day on traditional classroom instruction, Blackshear Elementary reopened as Austin ISD's first public elementary fine arts academy in the fall of 2014. Just one year later, it was one of 28 Texas schools given the Blue Ribbon Award by the Texas, by the U.S. Department of Education's National Award for Excellence in Education. Well, how did your child's school stack up? Right now at KXAN.com, you'll find an easy-to-look-up database for 438 public schools in the Austin area, analyzed by Children at Risk. It includes indicators for achievement, performance, growth, and college readiness.